One thought that's always crossed my mind every time I sat down to giggle at a Hannah Stocking video is, wow, this girl is not only extremely clever with her comedy, but she's extremely smart. I wish you would teach science. And luckily, it's finally here. Hannah Stocking not only teaches us a little bit of science, but she talks about a subject I don't think enough people are talking about. You need a fucking PhD to understand things as well as Hannah does, especially in the area she's about to cover. The importance of water to the human body. So the other day I was playing softball and I may have underestimated the power water has over the human body. Yeah, but how? Your body is literally fucking programmed to understand the importance of water to it. Now I understand in certain scenarios, like it's a hot summer's day during football practice and the coach has you running 100 yard dashes while giving them a piggyback ride and you go into the locker room to smack some ass cheeks and catch a golden shower from the quarterback and you may get dehydrated because you haven't had water in between the two activities. But that's be not because you underestimated the importance of the water. It's you didn't have access to it or it fell to the back of your agenda. What's up, guys? Hey. Yo. Yo, can I have some? What is that? You just drunk the water. Water is for the weak. Water is for toilets. Water is for my little turtle Sam, who actually died last week because he's weak. Hannah, you should drink water. It's hot outside. You're not going to drink that, are you? What kind of psychopath friend is that? Get that water out of my face, nerd. You're not gonna actually drink that shit, are you? You're gonna look mad fucking weak if you drink that water. If you're so thirsty, why don't you snort coke out of my asshole instead? <laughs> what did the water ever do to you? Loss of water is unevenly greater than the loss of electrolytes, aka salt. The osmotic pressure of extracellular fluids gets higher than in the cells, resulting in lower osmotic pressure. So because of this, you become dehydrated. Far be it for me to question the unorthodox methods of the master science professor Hannah Stocking, but I do think she showed up to class a little drunk for today's lecture. She's moving around like she's out of her mind inebriated. I've never seen so much animation or slow talking when reading the cue cards for the script here. I wish my professors acted like fucking Jack Sparrow every time they came to class, all wobbly and woobling around and shit. It's pretty fucking odd here, Hannah. I think you need some water. Hey, yo, Evelyn! Let me get one of those, uh... You need a water? I bet you're glad you didn't have that water, huh? It'll slow you down. <laughs> what? Yo, Hannah, are you cool? I'm cool, man. I'm not thirsty at all, man. <laughs> okay, then heck yeah! <laughs> Hannah, you're supposed to hit the ball! <sighs> Classic comedy, of course. The comedy stylings of Hannah Stocking never disappoint. This is less of a sketch about not understanding the importance of water and more of having a sociopathic friend. Hannah clearly understands the importance of water during the softball game, constantly trying to get water, but then her friend is literally slapping that shit out of her hand. This is more about having a bad friend that is actively trying to kill you. Thirst is the most prominent symptom of dehydration. You don't say. With thirst, you'll experience dryness of the mouth, a decrease in producing saliva, and a good old-fashioned difficulty of swallowing. How dumb do you think your audience is, Hannah, that you have to explain thirst to them? I'm pretty sure every human being on this planet has been thirsty at one point or another. I don't know if we really needed to cover these slides in this lecture here. Who needed a PSA that water is important for your body? It's been an old health experts saying to drink eight eight ounce glasses of water a day. The aliens are here. Yo, Hannah, everything I said was super wrong. You look terrible, you need water. Hannah, you should have had more water. <clears throat> yeah, the wheels in the sky, nobody see that. <laughs> Just me. Oh, somebody ordered water? Hannah Stocking is a goddamn pioneer, an innovator, able to effortlessly weave in this side-splitting comedy into a very important lesson. And I think it's safe to say we're all going to walk away from this video having much more knowledge as to the importance of water now. So thank you, Hannah, for your service. Thank you for this science lesson. Thank you, Hannah.